I expect in the future of Hong Kong will be the society is very stable and also Hong Kong people will be upgrade their living standard. Uh, everyone have the job and then have a very good pay and also everybody have chance to travel around the world uh, as well as in, in mainland China. And also uh, I, I think everyone will feel health because if you improve our uh, medical service and also we wanted to have uh, all the Hong Kong people have the good education. This year we celebrate the 25th anniversary of Hong Kong's reversion back to Chinese sovereignty and the setting up of the Hong Kong SAR. One country, two system is an experiment never implemented anywhere in the world and we have successfully made Hong Kong a financial commercial centre and the residents here enjoy the protection in their human rights and freedom as per the United, Conven United Nations Conventions. Uh, we have a sharp learning curve in how to develop our political system in that uh, from zero we wish to attain universal suffrage for the Chief Executive and the Legislative Council. Um, in the past 25 years, we've been moving forward until there was a failed color revolution in the years 2019 and 2020, in which we have to take stock and then revamp the uh, electoral system to make sure that patriots is the mainstay in the governance of Hong Kong. And we have done that successfully already. And as far as the e economy is concerned, uh, we remain a free economy. I wish to say that uh, it is very important to note that Hong Kong is ordained to practice capitalistic system for no less than 50 years from 1997 that we remain the financial center of the Greater Bay Area of China, which has got a population of 60 million people and is the largest engine in driving forth the economic growth in China. Uh, we are uh, given a role in the Belt and Road Initiative and a chance to join the RCEP, as well as in the 14th five years plan of China, uh, we are designated to be the financial centre, the commercial centre, the logistic hub, as well as a technological invention centre. With the inner circulation of the Chinese economy and the outer circulation uh, with Asia and the rest of the world, uh, Hong Kong is in the middle. China will continue to make most of Hong Kong for that reason. All in all, we are successful in implementing this experiment of one country system and we are still moving forward.